Now, I, I want to talk a little bit more about the family history of military because y'all have a deep family history. So, uh, Alyssa, coming back to you real quick, you, you made mention uh, on a previous call uh, about your father, um, who, if I understood it correctly, was not in actual combat, but saw the effects of combat in a way that very few of us understand. He was an OR technician and um, he was pretty open with his stories. And um, he struggled a lot with PTSD, which meant my family struggled. Um, and he would go to the meetings and I, I would see, he had friends that were amputees and he would tell me ahead of time, this is, we're gonna go see my friend. And when you see me shake his hand, it's gonna be a different way. And this is what happened to him. And this is how that happened. Um, he was very open with me about the things that he saw age appropriately. Like as I got older, he shared more um, about the effect of war and um, the importance of service. That was his, that was really, really important to him. So. And Glenn, your, your dad was in Vietnam. He, he was uh, not he actually in Vietnam. He actually signed up to go to Vietnam and they actually sent him to Korea. Hence, where I was, my brother and I were born at. Uh, he stayed there for four years, so actually. Wait, so uh, wait, if you're born in I, Korea, you, you just, you automatically look like you have a Korean, I mean, I, help, help me understand. No, I'm just kidding. That's kind of funny, actually, oh when, when you stop and think about it. There, there's, there's some jokes in there. There's some good humor in there. But so, so, so anyway, please continue. No, so, so he, uh, he you know, dropped out of high school and he was going to join the, the military and he was going to go fight in Vietnam and they ended up sending him to Korea. Uh, he had met my uh, <laughs> biological mother and ended up staying there. And he stayed there for four years, which most folks in the military, when I tell them that my father stayed in Korea for four years, that's unheard of. That's normally, it's a hardship tour. You do a one year tour and you leave. Uh, but he mm -hmm. stayed there for four years uh, uh, and then came back to the States. So um, very interesting.